It would allow an astronaut to stay on the moon's surface for several hours. And what's important is that walking around on the moon isn't just an, it's not just an airless environment. The temperature difference between night and day is almost 250 degrees. Military aviation, World War I, World War II, and the space age. I'm uh, fascinated by NASA because I am the same age as the manned space program, almost to the day. Boca had taught him everything he knew. Boca was later been legally blind since about 1990. I can see light and dark and shape, that's it. The, the world is pretty monochromatic to me. Okay, Bug, come on. I'm sure they had concerns about, you know, a blind guy leading tours, but my enthusiasm must have won them over. Generally, when they show up, they if they would like to have a tour, they will go to the docent desk and ask, can we have a, a guided tour? And whoever is available will step up. Now, let me get my bearings here. I can hear the raised eyebrows. It's, it's got to be uh, initial surprise, to this, to this but I put people at ease right away, and I let them know that, you know, I'm looking forward to giving them a tour. I introduced them to Musket, which immediately set people at ease because he's such a people dog. He loves people. Well, they eventually did come up with excellent aircraft. A conversation piece. He's a, he's a coffee table book that sheds. And there are so many times when I have been in a situation where I'm not really sure how to start a conversation or a presentation, Musket provides that first crack, you know. He is um, he's always willing to be the center of attention. The trick was making it a routine because his job is to get me from point A to point B safely. That's what a guide dog does. I have to know where to go, but there are areas where I'm not really sure where I am and I depend on his good eyes to get me to each exhibit and collection. And when we reach that spot and I say, good boy, and then we stop and I do my presentation and then we move on. He will get me pretty close to it. I mean, he'll stop right in front of the Fokker triplane or he'll stop right in front of the P-40 Warhawk or something. Dive bomber. And like any kid, I built model airplanes. When I grew up, model airplanes were no longer <laughs> feasible, especially when I couldn't see to build them anymore. But now I get to hang around with the real thing. And they built I have never had a negative reaction to a, a, any kind of tour or any kind of introduction. Everybody seems to be wonderful, and I get a lot of compliments afterwards, and of course Musket is a hit. I enjoy doing it. It's got to be one of the most unique volunteer jobs in the country. And observation planes frequently had a, an observer and a pilot.